I'm Joy! I'm angry, and we're watching Inside Out 2. You're not anger, <laughs> you're just angry. And if you guys want us to watch Inside Out 3, Riley's Rise to Puberty. This one's about puberty. What I mean, look, Riley's Menopause Adventure. If you guys want us to watch Inside Out 3, Menopause Adventures, get this video to 13,000 likes, and click the join button to become a YouTube member to get access to lots of exclusive content. We are expecting a great championship today with the Foghorn. <laughs> Dude, I just remembered that because she tries out for the hockey team in the first movie and she doesn't get in and she's like, I hate my life. But now she's here. Like, this is a character development moment right now. This is so cool. And now the, the bigger character development is she's finally going to realize that she's gay, like we theorized. No, it was like non-binary or some shit like that. Was she non-binary? People say that because she has male emotions and no other character has emotions of both genders. Wait, is that still Mindy Kaling? Is she, is she still here? Mindy Kaling and Bill Hader didn't come back. But Mindy Kaling's the GOAT, bro. She made the best show ever. I read a, a random article that said that they were reportedly offered 100k for the role and turned it down. That's it? Ta-da! Just because oh my gosh, she has a pimple. I've never seen a Pixar character with a pimple before. I didn't even know that was possible. Are they just making turning red for white people? And she's officially a teenager now. She got very tall. Gay? She is gay. I knew it. I have the gaydar. Creating beliefs. Homework should be illegal. <laughs> Get Up and Glow is the best band <laughs> It's so cringe. It's so cringe. It's okay. I drop things all the time. That's so relatable. Dude, I drop things sometimes too. I drop bars, dude. I'm... Turns out when you put all of those beliefs together, they make the most wonderful thing of all. Her sense of self. Dude, this movie's so good. I'm like so enthralled and we're only like seven centimeters in right now. I'm going to say that during se <laughs> That's gross. I'm an American. I don't even know how. I don't even know how much that is. I don't even know what that means. That's not very big. I have seven seven meters in. I only have two centimeters left, baby. The three of you were impressive. Thanks, Coach Roberts. I do a three-day skills camp. I invite all the best players in the area. Oh my gosh, she's gonna get that D1 offer. Oh my gosh, she's gonna play at the UCLA. Am I tripping right now? Or do the characters in this movie look like they could be in Lightyear? We are so proud of you. I'm not. I'm not proud of you. Are you mad just because you've never heard that? I go to my bed and my parents come over and hug me. We're so proud of you for being a successful cartoon reaction channel. <laughs> this is for all those memories that belong in the back of the mind. Oh, they send shit to the back of her mind. That's like Adventure Time Finn when he says like the vault. He puts the memories in the vault. The vault. That's where the stuff I can't handle goes. Kerplunk. We keep the best and top the rest. Woo. A There's new a new emotion. emotion. When's that part from the trailer? Oh my god, I just realized they haven't introduced the new emotions yet. I thought that that motherfucker in purple was anxiety. <laughs> He's not. <laughs> <laughs> Which one is he again? What is he? He's fear. He's fear. Oh my god, I forgot. You're the only one who hasn't been to the belief system. Oh my god, this looks so cool, bro. This is all from the Elio Scrapped movie. They're reusing the footage from that goddamn movie that's never gonna come out. Mom and Dad are proud of me. <sighs> How many people like cried because they've never heard that before? I'm about to cry, man. Huh? <sighs> what the heck is that? There's, There's a new emotion! emotion. I, I, I... This is where the emotions show up. Puberty button. Turning red button. Is it just me or does like disgust look kind of bad with her hair up? Oh, with that shower cap on? That shower cap on got me feeling some type of shower cappy way. Oh my God, it's Bing Bong. Bing Bong, he's alive. F it's not Bing Bong. Hey guys, I'm back. It's me, Bing Bong. Wow, I can't believe you're here, Bing Bong. This is not the song that they use in the trailers. A uh, new emotion. That's all I know. Just do whichever she says it, we have to clap. It's a new emotion. And then they show Goku with the fucking meme jacket. Like, I don't, I've seen too many memes of it to take it seriously. Get up. Camp time. Lunch break. Well, that's kind of fun. Because you're going through it while you're sleeping. Your body's developing. Yeah. I got my first period and I was sleeping as well. Can't you just lay off for like one second? Uh much no! <laughs> yes! yes we got another one we got another one 
What do you mean? Was that in the trailer? It was in the Monster vs. Alien show video when when the when the cockroach guy says overreact react much. much. Oh. Bell Ortiz is the captain now. Track right. Zoom in. Right there. So? She's hiding something. But what? Dude, I don't feel guilty like like thirsting over. You know what? Like disgust. I'm not disgusted. That's all I'm gonna say. You know what I mean? I'm not disgusted. We we got assigned to a different high school. Wait, they're going to a different school. No friends. Now you have no friends. Oh my god, the zoning, bro. Her friends aren't rich enough because they don't live on that one street. So like, she has to go with all the rich people. The middle school to high school split up, bro. <laughs> the way her minority friends are getting zoned out of the school. No, literally, dude. Here we are. This looks really cool. Did you guys ever go to camp? I've only ever gone to music camp. I went to math camp once. I, I went to theater camp. We're all really f cool. <laughs> <laughs> we're we're f nerds, bro. We're f nerds. Whoa, hey. Are you okay? Hello. She looks like the woman from Wreck-It Ralph. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Gal Gadot. I'm anxiety. I'm one of Riley's new emotions. Oh my god, she's gonna say it. Oh my god. A new, new emotion? emotion? Say it. Say the f***ing line. Please, if you don't say it, I'm gonna f***ing die. Who the heck are you? Uh, I'm Envy. Oh yes, Ayo Adibri, bro. She's so cute. Oh, the boredom. Well, come on up here, Onward. Am I saying right? Onward? Dude, shout out Onward, man. Is it just me or has she not said a new emotion yet? She doesn't say it, bro. She doesn't say it. That's the Blobby's gonna puke of this movie. Blobby's gonna puke. They f said it and that was like the biggest meme. Maybe they cut the scene because they saw it was such a big meme. They're like, we cannot have this in the movie. And we're looking at the following likely scenarios. First, we don't take this camp seriously and we goof off with Brie and Grace. I just want her to take like anxiety medication and then like a guy shows up with a gun and kills anxiety. Oh my God, that's awesome. You're the boss. <laughs> Remember when we all finally came up to headquarters? Oh, nostalgia. A new emotion. Is she gonna f say it, dog? Like, what the f Hey, you wanna sit with us? Oh, she wants to sit with us. <gasps> Everything is beautiful. You guys talked about taking some anxiety meds. It literally murders anxiety. <laughs> like, she, so she has a death scene in, in Inside of 3. It's like the pill guy from Osmosis Jones. Like, he just pulls up and takes out anxiety. You think Osmosis Jones ever, like, ran into Plan B? Dapped, dapped up Plan B. Yeah, they, they had a whole thing. I need your focus. Which means now I'm going to need your cell phones. Are you f kidding me i would have beat like beat her to death what the f is that shit dude i used to go to the f worst junior high ever dude like no one was allowed to have phones in school everybody had to wear a strict dress code and people kept pooping in the sinks that they had to remove the sinks from the bathrooms bro like i just have all these bad memories that are coming back now bro were you some of these people that were pooping in them sinks <laughs> No, I was not. I didn't poop in the sink. I was sinking in the poop, bro. Well, you know, when I see the poop sink, it's just, you know, double and pass it on to the next guy. <laughs> that Michigan girl is off to a rough start. Oh, no. Are they talking about us? Anxiety. Anxiety. What's this one again? Fat? It's eating disorder. That's this one. So you're not allowed to joke about that, Jack. Seriously. If I have one, I'm allowed to joke about it, bro. Form your teams for the rest of camp. Down. You want to be on team one? Let's go. She made a promise to her friend. Oh my god, they made a promise. <laughs> Dude, anxiety is such a f***ing shit disturber in this movie. I kind of love it. She's just the new sadness, basically. Like, she comes in and f***s everything up. I love anxiety. Hey, welcome to our team, Michigan. Dude, you switched up, bro. This movie's speaking to me in a way that I wasn't really ready when watching this movie. Like, I'm like, hold up, like, what the f***? Like, a little bit too real. Your life as a experiencing puberty as a teenage girl, it was difficult for you, I can imagine. Bro had to sink in poop and do puberty as a teenage girl. Like, that's legitimate. Like, I, I don't think of a worse existence. <laughs> <laughs> you can't just bottle us up. That's a great idea. <laughs> I love anxiety. She's an evil villain in this. No, I like her. I'm on her side. I 
but her heavy. Yes, this is awesome. How do we build a new Riley, which I'm loving, by the way, amazing concept, if it took them 13 years to build the old one? I'm I'm so fascinated by this. This is not at all the direction I was expecting the movie to go. They're artificially making one of these like core strings or whatever. The vault, it's Adventure Time. This is what you guys were talking about. Yeah, with Finn. Adventure Time Finn. This canonizes. Finn's in here. <laughs> is he in here? This is the HBO Max vault. You know what we call that? Denial. Can you say denial? Whoa, what? 2D character, yes! Oh, she buried it because she's in her teenage phase where she doesn't want to admit she likes cartoons, but she still secretly watches Gravity Falls. Riley, you don't understand. We're in a new generation. It's okay to watch Bluey as an adult. Dude. I hate to say it, Riley would be a spilling the milk viewer. No. I hate to, no, I hate no, to say it. No, I hate to say no. it. Indeed. Welcome to your eternal fate. Oh, I remember seeing some footage of this guy. Oh, it's the anime guy. Oh, it's just Cloud Strife, okay. Why is he here? Yeah, I always thought Riley had a secret crush on him. There's no way a 13-year-old girl is suppressing her love for Cloud Strife. I feel like this is when you, like, expel your f love for the characters like that or i shall set you all free it's a pretty good emulation of video game type animation too yeah i've never seen that in a video game now it's your turn to help us this looks so weird this image is so fucking weird it's gumball you can tell me this is an episode of gumball right now hi everybody I'm Pouchy. I love the animation. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> we I'm kind of done right now. I don't. <laughs> I like Pouchy, bro. He reminds me of Arlo for some reason. Get back in there. Oh, oh, what are we gonna do? Oh, disgusted one. As you once believed in me. Oh my God, he's so me. He's so me right now. And that single frame spawned 300,000 fan art images. Oh my God, the shipping art is gonna go so crazy. <laughs> bro is rolling, why is bro rolling? Why is bro rolling like that? You want us to go all the way to the back of the mind? Are you out of your mind? That implies that they have emotions in their own minds. That kind of implied that right there. How deep does it go? We need eight inside out movies to flesh that out. All the way to the back of the mind. There we'll find the Riley we know and love. And then I tell anxiety, hey, don't worry so much. <laughs> <laughs> That'll work. Oh my God. Joy would be a great therapist. Honestly, I'm gonna dump my current one. Let me get Joy in here. She's like taming the waters. This is so evil, dude. She's polluting the water. She's making the frogs gay right now. We're halfway through this movie. That is crazy. This movie's going by in a blink of an eye. This movie's good. A good movie. I like good movies. I like when things are good. I can understand why this movie made a billion dollars. I'm glad it uh, beat out the Mario movie. Thank God. It's an actual movie. <laughs> it would have doubled its budget if Chris Pratt voiced Riley. Because everything Coach thinks about you is in there. The good and the bad. Oh my god, no, she's gonna go into the book and then the coach is gonna catch her and be like, you can't be on the team. And oh my god, it's gonna happen. I can't watch, I can't watch it. Oh my god, no. I, I was I was confused because I was like, is she gonna, like you meant go into the book, like she's gonna teleport into the book. Like I was confused for a second. Like, I've been watching an anime where a girl did that. So I was very confused for a second. I'm like, what? Inside out is gonna go inside of a book? Uh, why do our arms swing like that when we walk? Try to keep them still. Oh my god, this is some next level anxiety, bro. Just walk. Oh my god! I'm just waiting for them to look into the camera and say, you are now breathing manually. Th th she's walking like this, bro. Just pretend we get the joke. <laughs> <laughs> Help! Help. Thank God, like, I've never had a situation like that. And I just, you know, a social butterfly. I can't even relate to that scene. The pretending to laugh at something when you d didn't hear what the joke was is just such a, I feel like a universal embarrassing experience. I was all over them in middle Are you school. you serious? Yeah, I was a glow girly. Relax. Oh. No, we need a band they think is cool. Simple plan, simple plan. Come on, Brockhampton. What what band do they think is cool? What if they say Four Town from Turning Red? That would be sick. Maybe like uh, Billy Eyelash. <laughs> My favorite band. You don't still like get up and glow, do you? Bro, she's 12. Yeah. She's so young. You don't still like that shit. Oh, yeah. I love get up and glow. Love. Get up and no! Not the sarcasm. Oh, it turned into a chasm. It turned into a chasm. Why are they representing sarcasm in this negative way? Fuck. 
The, what is Pixar trying to say? Run for your lives! Sarcasm? Really? Even she doesn't like the joke. I honestly love disgust. She's like carrying this movie for me. Now that she's not Mindy Kaling, like I have no guilt. Like I'm like, I'm all in. I'm all in. I want to know who voices her now. Oh yeah, we had a great time. Oh, Oh. oh my god, the sarcasm is getting bigger. Evil sarcasm makes the sarcasm, but like funny sarcasm? Does funny sarcasm make it like smaller? <laughs> Maybe we can get some appreciation for the beauty of comedy, the connecting ability. Fort Pillerton's still here, and it even got bigger. <laughs> You think Bing Bong is, is still here? <gasps> Bing Bong's smoking dubs. He's smoking big doinks in Pillow Fort land. Now is the time to send up every possible thing that could go wrong. We are looking to the future. Like, these are the stockbrokers of the emotions. Look at oh, it's the animators. They're literally the overworked animators. They're using Riley's imagination against her. Val and her friends like us now, but if we don't make the team, will they like us tomorrow? This movie's too real. This movie, it's very like, like I feel like a white girl right now, but like this movie- is the movie of the summer it is it's the movie of the summer and like yeah we rented this shit we didn't i should watch this in a theater i wish i watched this in a theater anxiety has got you all chained to desk drawing nightmares is this what it's like at the animation studios in north korea the ones working on invincible season two all the north korean animators animated for the movie <gasps> This is so wholesome, oh my god. Joy was literally like, stop thinking that. I wish my brain cells could do this. This is what it feels like to take anxiety medication, oh my god. Are we pushing her too hard? We gotta see what's in the notebook. It's the only way for us to know how we can do better. We gotta. We gotta see what's in the notebook. There's no possible way the scene can end well. Oh my god, this is gonna make me- Oh god, don't do it. What if nothing bad happened? <laughs> like, we hyped this up so hard. What if the coach is actually an alien who's harvesting them? And Riley just isn't- She's not ready yet. She's not ready to be harvested. She's about to be abducted by aliens? Like, what? This is all a simulation? We can't let these bad ideas get to Riley. Ah! It's a brainstorm. Oh, I get it. It's a brainstorm. I think that's just an ocular headache. Oculus? Rift? What? If Riley takes one of these ideas, it could be a disaster! Joy! The only way out is up! Oh my god, that's a movie that they made. Holy shit. Do you think Doug's gonna be in the tube with them? And he's gonna be like, I'm a dog, but you can hear me talk. Bro's gonna say squirrel, man. It's gonna be hilarious. <laughs> Oh, she's gonna try too hard and then she's gonna hurt herself. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, this is like when Knives dyed her hair in like Scott Pilgrim. And then Ramona, like the dude punched the, the color out of her hair. Todd. Okay, I see you're in your zone. Get ready to score some goals. Yeah. She's gonna choke so hard, bro. It's over. She's gonna choke. This movie's so cringe, man. This is what it felt like watching it, Turning Red the first time. Yeah. I'm a good person. There's a lot more focus on the emotion side, I think. Yeah, so they can sell plushies. Give him a buy an anxiety plushie, bro. The marketability of this character is so f good, man. Here we go. I'm not good enough. What? I'm not good enough. I've been saying that the whole movie, Riley. You should have just looked at me. When you try your best, but you don't succeed. When you get what you want, but not what you need. If Coldplay did the soundtrack, 10 out of 10 movie. Right now it's at a 9.9, .9, but Coldplay would have would have bumped that shit up. I don't know how to stop anxiety. I like how frazzled she is. Like she really looks like she got up, bro. The messy hair, bro. Like someone f her up. That's all I'm saying, bro. This is the morning after. She met up with Plan B and Osmosis Jones, bro. Yes, go, go, go. If you took the audio files for this video, it would be like, whoa. <laughs> you could visually see us progressively getting more engaged in the movie. I just wish it wasn't hockey at the end. I wish it was like a cool sport, like curling or fencing or something more Canadian. 
<gasps> Pochi! Yes! Dude, you said that like a kid watching that type of show core. Yes! Pochi! He's back! A roll of tape? A rubber duck? No time! Huh? <laughs> he invaded his space! That's disgusting. I know what to do, but we're gonna need a lot more dynamite. You know? Oh my god, he's rolling up the sleeves. Oh. That's such a fun... Oh my god. Anger's so cool. Come on, Riley! One more goal! The dynamite, it's all 2D, it's so cute. Let me light it up like it's dynamite. I came to dig, 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 dig. I'm, I'm gonna, dude, I, I low-key wish I, I watched this in theaters, bro. You still can. That's true, but I already watched it for the first time online. Oh, this hurts, bro. This hurts. Race had that f***ing coming, dude. Let's be honest. You can't be bringing up the cringy band of the cool lesbian girl party. Like, she had that shit coming. I'm not good enough. Oh, no. What did I do? Oh my gosh, she's having an anxiety attack. Oh my god, this is the Garfield or Puss in Boots. Where's dog? Where's 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 dog from Puss in Boots? Pedrito, Pedrito. Come on, Riley, get it together. I'm not good enough. You have to. See this girl's about to have a heart attack at 13. Okay, is it just me or is it not that deep? Like low key, like it's just talk. <laughs> Oh, all the emotions together. That's cool. Anxiety tornado. How do you think they're gonna execute her? Stoning? Guillotine? Probably with like prescribed medication. I'm a good person. She has such a high value of herself, bro. Yeah, like maybe say like, I'm like a decent person. I'm an all right person. Like don't be so conceited. I was just trying to protect her. All right, beat the shit out of her. Oh my God, they all right. like fight back, fight back. <laughs> they start kicking her. Take that. What the f is gonna happen? Like, this ain't good. I don't think it's gonna stop the thing. This is what actually, like, this is what happens when we let 13 year olds drink energy drink. What prime energy does to it, a child heartbeat. Oh my god. I need to fit in, but I wanna be myself. I'm brave, but I get scared. Oh my god, I'm good and that's bad. Or I'm bad and, and I'm not bad. I'm good. Wreck it, Ralph. She she doubles down on being a bad person. <laughs> she she start, she takes off her skate and starts bludgeoning Grace's head in. That would be sick. <laughs> no one invited anxiety to the group hug. Steven Universe awe ending. Let's be honest here. They all hugged and then it's over. If you don't want to be friends anymore, I get it. So emotionally mature. She should just hold a grudge for the next three years when they're in the same school and never talk to each other ever again. Like that would be the most realistic thing she could do in this situation. Extremely emotionally mature. You're supposed to put your hand on top. It's like a thing we do. <laughs> this is spilling the milk though. Okay, let's be honest. I'm Riley, Core's the black girl, and then you're Grace. They let her play after what she, that's kind of f***ed up that they still let her play. Yeah, that, that girl she pushed down like actually broke like several bones. She's never going to be able to play this sport again. She didn't even push her. She just ran into her because she was so focused on the goal. She wasn't looking around. She body checked her, guys. That's what it's called in hockey. Minnesota. Oh my god, they call her Minnesota now. It doesn't have the same ring to it. Michigan was better. Yeah, for real. She can be bored, but never boring. But she can be a little sarcastic from time to time. That's the act like that's a bad thing. You know what? This movie's good. Good film. But they literally say like act like sarcasm is shit. Sarcasm is a beautiful art, a beautiful part of comedy that this movie is against. And I legitimately pisses me off. Every messy, beautiful piece of her. She made the team. She got the text because it was six minutes later. She made the team. No, she was excited because she didn't make it because she actually hates hockey and she was pretending the whole time. She was actually, she saw that Amazing Digital Circus was renewed for season two. That's why she was so excited. <laughs> she goes away for three days and all we get is 
Go and then what about the red in her hand? Well, after credit. Wait, why do why have her parents developed anxiety? What the f is happening in this household right now? I'm actually concerned. You know, they take their meds with the with the food, so it hasn't kicked in yet. Like both her parents have clinical anxiety, and that's it's just starting to manifest in Riley, and they haven't noticed yet. Yeah. So it's hereditary. If you guys want to watch hereditary, get this video to 600 million likes uh and subscribe. Thanks to our patrons: Light Animation, Adam Sear, Aeromir, Ali Link, Alzheimer's is a bad disease, we should cure it, Anna Gooch, Arachna Droid, Aaron Tietzen, Atomic Leon, Farsan, Bento, Calm Luke, Cosmic Vega, Daddy Diarrhea, Dante Estefan, Diablo. Chiquita, Dixie Dominator Dan, Fletch Trollgage, Frozen Spaghetti, Gabriel Granados, George White, George White, Gub Stargazer, Helio Hummus, Isaiah Alfred, Kai Hallow, Lilac Moon, Lovely Fish 34, Michael Rodriguez, Mr. Marcus Blitz, Merc 55, Nathaniel, Native 5, Omega Waffles, by the way, Penny Pen Pen, Please Gamer ZL, Pop Ellie Man, Potato MZ, Rabbit of Turbinog, R Dizzle, Ryan Thompson, Rocky Robo Sprinkles, Rythoka, Saul Goodman, Sir Kaiju, Spill in the Pilk, Tyrant Stills, Tarjan, Falx Blissett, Victoria, Winzy, and Wolf's